What is going on, dudes? My name is Soto13. Welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Way Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we made it here to Opelucid City. Uh, we ended up losing Peking, which absolutely sucks. We got a new uh, team member in Iris, so that's pretty awesome. In this episode, we're going to be taking on the Opelucid City Gym. I'm also going to do some exploring. So, this thing has Truant, which really sucks, but it does have a really good move set. So, hopefully, we're only able to leave it in for one turn, then we're good. <laughs> I already talked to Drayton, so we don't need to go there. But uh, there's a couple places we can check out here. I think there's a hidden item here. I don't remember. No. A hidden item somewhere else, though. There's a hidden item here. A bug gem. <laughs> Great. Okay. Oh, yeah. I forgot the, the battle house. It's a, a destiny knot. Okay. That's not too bad. If you would have given actually me the TM attract... Then you would have given me some random TM, which would have been awesome. You need eight gym badges to challenge the... Yeah, I get it. You know, I wonder what Iris is going to have. <laughs> That's what I wonder. That'd be cool. I mean, obviously, she's not going to keep Dragon-type Pokemon. Uh, well, she might. She might. I don't think it's randomized by base stat total, but it might just be. So, we what we can do in here is there are a couple triple battles that we're allowed to have. Welcome, as the name suggests, triple battles. Yeah, I know, I know how they work. Oh, yeah, so I didn't even mention, you saw that we ended up uh, doing the the route over there and then training these guys up. I did use an XP code, as you saw. Um, so, basically, what we're going to do is we're going to use half our team for one triple battle and then half of them for the other. So, should be a pretty cool thing, and I'll get some decent XP. What does Magic Code do? And you have Motor Drive! Come on! Let's see how much Foul Play does. Nice! Mud shot. Okay, great. We're gonna hit this Volpix with a gunk shot. Hopefully, do a lot of damage. Yeah, choice banded gunk shot. Maria levels up. Sweet. Are you gonna learn anything? Spike cannon. Nah. Okay, let's see how this goes. How do they both have motor drive? What the hell? <laughs> That's stupid! Oh my gosh. Alright, hit the course of the Shadow Ball. Does a fairly decent amount of damage. I forgot I gave Chloe the Life Orb, actually. And he missed the Gunk Shot! You son of a gun. Alright, well, let's go. Gunk Shot once more, Shadow Ball in the course of And Darmanitan hopefully should get knocked out by this fly. I would hope. We need it. <laughs> Boom! There we go. Alright, completed the first triple battle successfully. <laughs> Iris gains level, which is very, very nice. Chloe does too. There we go. That was my goal, is to get everyone to level 38 by doing this. Maria gets to level 39. Hell yeah. Alright, so now we're gonna challenge her up here. So, let's do this. Shit! Sorry if everything shook for a moment. I was moving my desk. Alright, we're gonna just use Jump Kick, because I don't trust Dynamic Punch, and it should... Yeah, it still does a lot of damage. What is with my luck? Come on! <laughs> Alright, well... That's gonna hurt. Yeah. Alright, we're just gonna hit the Blitzel this time because I can't hit it with an Aqua Tail. And it goes down. There we go. Good job. Okay, let's see. Can Lancelot hit the Dynamic Punch? Casper levels up. Sweet. Can, let's see. Yeah, he leans a dynamic punch. Goodbye, Cloyster. And I don't think Outrage will kill the Pinnacle, but I suppose we can always try. Why not? Tesla levels up. Very nice. Lancelot does too. Yeah, that's what I wanted. All right. Casper almost did too, because that gained a lot of XP, actually. I think that I let. I am sorry. I left the XP code on. That's why they grew so many levels. Forgot about that. I thought I had to hit the, actually, the left button in order to do that. I didn't actually know that. All right, we're just going to hit the pinnacle with a nice fang, and there we go. So we did beat this guy pretty quick. Yeah, that's more reasonable XP. <laughs> I'm sorry. That was a complete bad mistake on my part. All right, let's go in this house. I don't, I think there's something special we can get. Props. Great. Sure. 63 different. Okay, that's great. Uh, what, do you give me anything? Sure. What is it? 
Okay, the gift box? Okay, suppose there wasn't nearly as much to Opelousa's city as I thought there was. So, we're just gonna go challenge the gym now. This gym has one of the coolest designs. Yeah, this is... Wait. This is the one with the dragons, right? Or is that black and white too? And a black and white too at least had them. Ah. Uh, anyway. Unknown! This actually looks like it's gonna be a really difficult gym. If the trainers have level 41 Pokemon. But I suppose if we're able to just wreck their faces like that, then it's not that big of a deal. Let's battle! You've got Ice Burn. Alright, well, we're gonna fly. And the Needle Queen goes down. There we go. Good job, Tesla. Very proud of you. I'm getting a lot of XP. I turned off the code, I promise. You saw me turn it off, actually. So, um... <laughs> Alright, let's just swap to Chloe. Chloe can come out up front. Raise the hand and the head. All right, well, I don't remember where we gotta go. Do I think, yeah. Do we have to go down? Okay, this actually leads us somewhere. We can battle this guy and then do this again. I don't really understand how the dragon's heads move, but you know what, I don't really care. Because all I have to do is, it's a pretty linear pattern. All right, we got Chloe out here. Let's just go for surf, I suppose. Bite, okay. Don't you flinch me out. Don't flinch me again. Fudge off, that is stupid. Like, Serene Grace flinch hacks, that's perfectly okay. But this, this is just stupid. Bite flinch hacks from a freaking Raichu. Chloe, I need you to hit this surf. Thank you. My gosh, this stupid Raichu. Yeah, we're swapping you out because you can't do a thing. We'll just go into uh, Lancelot. We'll go for Aqua Tail. Do as much damage as we can because Aqua Tail is a pretty powerful move. Yeah, oh wow. Okay, well, he just set up his own death, actually. Because it's going to knock him out. Oh, good job, Electric. Alright, we'll jump on this hand. And I think this will make the dragon's head move up. Yes. It's been a while since I've done this. Like, it's been so long since I last played these games before doing this Let's Play. I just really wanted to play them. Because they're, like, one of my favorite, like, groups of Pokemon games. I don't know, I really love the second gen games, and I really love these games, uh, over all of them. The story in these games is awesome, I mean, obviously the, the battles look amazing, they run in 60 FPS, and they look just really cool, how they're animated and whatnot, I don't know. I like them more than, uh, the stuff they have nowadays. This is gonna hurt. Oh my gosh, Iris! All right, I decided to swap because I, oh my gosh, why did you get a crit? Oh, uh, this game hates me today. We'll go for foul play, actually. Can you stop with the Shadow Force, please? Shadow Force doesn't have a high crit ratio, does it? All right, the second dragon. We should have made this one white. Had a white and a black dragon. Well, actually, they have three dragons. They should have made one gray, one black, one white. That'd been cool. All right, he's got an Anorith. With Cloud9. Okay. Um, I am just gonna go for a Choice Bandit. Well, you actually just spelled your own death, so good job. We're gonna- a Choice Bandit Dragon Cloud will wreck half of your health, at least, so. Might have even knocked you out completely. Good idea for going for Belly Drum, you know. Zoom! Alright, so now we can go down the stairs and face this girl. It's kind of funny how they actually make you challenge every guy in the gym. Like, you can't, uh, not. <laughs> in order to get through the gym, you have to battle everyone. Sorry about that. So now we have an Ambipom here. I'm gonna go for a Choice Band of Dragon Claw. You missed your hammer arm. Good. <laughs> this should do a lot of damage. Yeah. I'm really surprised I didn't one-hit kill him. Ooh, that scared me a bit. All right, well, the Ambipom goes down. Good job, Iris. You leveled up, baby. All right, now you've got a Tangrowth, actually. All right, well, I'll go into Lancelot, who has got Ice Fang, so it'll be able to wreck him. Ow. God, I hate Tangros defense. Takedown. Woo! Made my heart. Let's skip a beat. Okay, we're gonna stay in and then swap because I wanna be able to get uh, Lancelot to level up. Gravity. Alright, well, we're not. Really? Okay, I guess that was some pro plays. I did not know that. Jump. That. <laughs> Okay, they get all the hacks. Uh, all right, well, anyway, that was not bad. We did end up uh, getting a couple levels and some stuff. Now we gotta heal up again. 
All right, we're gonna continue on. We're jumping onto the third dragon this time. Uh, yeah. I knew I knew that was the one that had to do this, so you have to backtrack and stuff. Y'all should know this. I'm just, I don't know why I'm even talking over this. Probably should just cut through it all. I cut a lot of stuff out when it comes to videos because uh, if you saw everything that I did, like when I went to editing, there's so much silence. Me just sitting there doing the tedious stuff because I like no joke when watching people play video games or doing any videos on YouTube. I really don't like to, to watch the stupid stuff. Like the stuff that takes really, really long. Come on. That lowers my speed. Please tell me that lowers my speed. Dang it. Anyway, uh, I just, I really don't like watching it. So, whenever it comes to my videos, I make sure to cut every bit of it out. Because I just don't understand how people like, uh, the bigger YouTubers who do absolutely nothing with their content. They don't, uh, make any effort to cut anything that's boring or irritating out. Like the Wonder Wedlock? I cut all the stuff. Oh, yes, we're learning that. But I cut, I cut out all the old stuff. And, or not old stuff, all the boring crap. And stuff that I didn't really want, um, but I, d I don't I don't leave it in because it's not fun for me to watch because I have to watch it back while editing, and it's not fun for other people to watch, in my opinion, because I don't know. There are a bunch of Poketubers who literally do no sort of editing besides layouts. I do all everything. <laughs> I put hard work and effort into my content, so that is um, that is my little rant for today. Because it just popped into my mind. Anyway, uh, Lancelot takes care of that very nicely. Good job, Lancelot. And you learned Dragon Claw. I meant I should have gotten rid of Dynamic Punch. I know I did not mean <laughs> to forget Aqua Tail. I wasn't even thinking because I love uh, having uh, the the Dynamic Punch is a you know a stab move, but it's only good when it hits, and that isn't very often. Hello, another veteran, ten years experience. Ooh, I actually have over 10 years of experience doing battles myself, buddy. I've been playing Pokemon for over 10 years. I've been playing Pokemon for probably like 12 or 13, actually. All right, Dynamic Punch. Can we hit? Oh, no. Don't let it sit up. Can we hit the Dynamic Punch? No! This is the fourth Dynamic Punch. This thing is plus four in both attack stats. You've got to be... You Swear to gosh, if you do not hit this... Come on! Oh, come on! How did the mill take out speed me, actually? That wasn't even a crit? But it just got all it, all that defense. What? That doesn't even make... Or, or, what? I don't even get it, man. Alright. Hit this thing with the attack order. I better get my Rocky helmet back. We'll stay in, I suppose. Oh my goodness! Can you stop at the status conditions, maybe? How is everything out speeding, Tesla? Like, that's the thing I want to know. <laughs> it doesn't even make sense. I don't know. I don't want to toy scarf him because he's too good. I just checked through my TMs, and nothing physical can Lancelot learn, which sucks. I really wanted him to learn some physical moves. Will this bring me up to Iris? Thank you! My goodness, we need to go up there. Alright, I'm switching Lancelot out of the front because he has no dynamic punches. So, uh, when in doubt, going to... Sure, we'll go to Tesla. I meant to do Casper, you know. But, anyway. Oh, well, now I can't go back on the dragon. Sweet! Alright, let's save right in front of Iris here. I really wish it was Drayden. Drayden is a lot cooler than Iris. Iris actually irritates me a lot. Anyway, let's get to the battle. Hi, I'm Iris, the basically strong team leader. Tell me, what Pokemon are you using? How will you fight? I'm super curious, so let's just get started. Oh wait, you're just a kid. I hated that in the anime. Uh, yeah. I kind of stopped watching after fourth generation. Tried to get back into it. It was just terrible. Anyway, you're gonna lead out with Zatu. So, I suppose I am glad I let out with uh, ten or Tesla, because he's got Shadow Claw. And I, I don't know why I almost said Tenzin. Rain Dance. Okay, that's cool. If I get the chance to use um, either my Pokemon with Surf, that'll help them out. <laughs> get wrecked, dude. 
She's gonna use both her hyper potions on the Zatu. Sweet, let's see if we can get a crit on this Shadow Claw. Huh? It did less damage. Low rolls. Venishock. Okay. Did you outspeed me before? Why did you get the crit? That's what I don't understand, is this game gives me so many crits against me. But oh well, I don't care. A Cresselia! <sighs> My poor B King! <laughs> I don't even know what uh, base moves it had to begin with. I don't think it had anything decent because I changed its entire moveset. Anyway, I, I did teach this thing Gunk Shot, by the way. This thing. Casper. Howl. Okay. Yeah, physical attack is definitely your strong point. Crit foul play. I'm sorry. Good thing you weren't actually peeking. A Jirachi. That is a cool Pokemon. Now, this is probably one of the coolest I've seen in this Let's Play. So, let's just go for foul play, I suppose. Nast. Oh, no. <laughs> I need you to stop that right now. Uh, when can I even use it's good against you, I suppose? Nothing really. I suppose foul play is just my best option. Okay. Well, you know, it's kind of funny because he went for Nasty Plot and then decided to go for Slam. Good job. There we go. Yeah. We beat Iris really actually pretty easily. I'm really happy Casper picked up the last two kills. Casper is one of my favorite Pokemon on this team. Whoa, that was so cool. So happy I could battle a trainer. Oh, I mean a kid as strong as you. We get the Legend Badge, which is one of the coolest badges in Pokemon. Yeah, baby! Not bad. Alright, hurry up. Stop talking. What it will put Alright, what are you gonna give me rather than Dragon Tail? That's an actual TM! It's like TM95 or something like that, but freaking I don't care about the victor the Pokemon League will do it eventually. I I I have been had had really bad TM luck, and I also can't speak apparently. Did I choose the wrong answer? I mean, I hope I didn't. Oh well. Anyway, we got another Master Ball. Alright everybody, so what we're gonna really quick run up here and do is get our encounter for this next, uh, route. I don't even remember what the route is, but, uh, there's a bunch- What do you want? Just- There's a big storm. Ooh, Tornadus! Ooh, we may go do that. Hold on one sec. Anyway, um, or Thunderous. I think it's Thunderous, actually, in this game. Alright, here's our encounter for this route. A shift tree. Okay, not bad. I will take it. Please don't attack me again. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Stay there. All right, we're just gonna go for a dust ball. We gotta go for right off the bat because this thing is gonna hit me, and then when it does, it's gonna get hurt by the rocky helmet. No! We lost our encounter. No! Oh, thank goodness. Ooh, apparently doesn't hit on the physical side. That is very good. Let's go for a Cherish Ball. One of the coolest Pokeballs in the game. You definitely want to get in this ball. Oh yeah, baby. Alright, I was so scared it was going to knock itself out because of the Rocky Helmet damage. Anyway, I probably should have put it to sleep anyway, but it's all good. Alright, what do I want to name you, I suppose? Why do I always say I suppose recently? Goodness gracious, Caleb. We're going to name it Cali. I was going to name it California, but I don't really want to. I don't even know if it'll fit, but... I wanted to name it that because it reminded me of, like, the Great Woodwood, Redwood Trees. Wedwood Trees. A freaking Latios! Are you kidding me? So we decided to run, decide to run back and heal up so we can check out Cali, the Redwood Tree, Shift Tree, whatever. He's got a hasty nature. Okay, not bad with Mole Breaker, Vice Grip, Razor Shell, Sky Attack, and Hyper Voice. You've actually got a pretty good moveset. I may think about bringing you into the team. But, uh, we basically have... How many is that? That's eight. So we have 14 total Pokemon uh, for the Pokemon League. Oh my gosh, look at that. I forgot how cool the, the storm was. All right, so basically what we're going to be doing is I bought some Pokeballs and stuff um, because we're going... I ended up buying some Dust Balls, some Quick Balls, and some Timer Balls. Didn't mean to do that. Let me get out. Thank you. Woo. Dust Balls, Timer Balls, and stuff. So hopefully we'll be able to capture the Tornadus or Thunderous. I don't remember which one it is. But, uh, if we can catch, if we can actually fight the thing, that'd be awesome. Oh, oh, Thunderous, can we fight? It, I think it's randomized anyway, because it's a legend. I 
Um, son of a gun. Okay. I ran into a wild battle and then I found it. And then this thunderstorm appeared. Apparently the game just needed me to en encounter a Pokemon to jog its memory. Oh, okay, it's not randomized. Cool, I love Thunderous, actually. It's a really cool Pokemon. All right, so now I don't know if it's going to flee or not. So the question is, do I go Dusk Ball or do I do Quick Ball? Or we could just use one of my Master Balls. Booyah! I get to capture Thunderous because it's an event Pokemon. I don't really care. Um, we can decide if we want to use it or not. Spikes and Steel Discharge Men, Bolts of Lightning. Not bad. We're going to give a nickname to you. I'm going to name you Thor because that's what I name every one of my Thunderous, especially the ones I love to use in Wi-Fi because they're so cool. Thunderous Therian is the best. I don't know if I have a reveal or where we get the reveal glass, but if I get it soon, I'm going to get it so we can get a Therian form. Adamant Thor with Sticky Hold, Icy Wind, Aqua Tail, False Swipe, and Dizzy Punch. I want to check you out, actually. I want to see how good is your attacks. So they're pretty much equal. Oh, I really want to use you. Uh, you guys will see for the next episode who will be dropped on the bench uh, in place of our Thunderous here. Because I'm going to teach him some moves. And I also, as you see, I forgot uh, Surf on uh, Maria for Needle Arm. So pretty cool stuff. Alright everybody, that is where I'm going to be ending this episode of our Pokemon Extreme Randomizer No Sock. If you enjoyed, thanks so much for watching. In the next episode, we'll be heading up, probably getting through Victory Road. Uh, and then in the episode after that, we'll be taking on the Pokemon League. It's hard to believe we're nearly done with the game. Hopefully we can beat the Nuzlocke. Just cross your fingers. Oh, anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I really do hope you enjoyed it. If you did, like, so much, appreciate it. And yeah, thank you all so much for watching. And I will talk to you all later.